Hello everyone again, I'm Brackness from Enjoy Kids. I'm the lead game developer uh, on my team, of course, Enjoy Kids. Uh, so today's subject is five steps to success. Uh, so before the start, I want to introduce myself to you guys. Uh, so you can relax. I just wrote my speech to WhatsApp to text myself. Uh, I'm 19 years old game developer. I develop games since childhood. So you can ask me, so if you are 19 years old, uh, you develop games since childhood. So that means you develop games uh, to, you started to game de develop games two years ago. But no, I've, I've been working with Unity uh, since 2014, which means I was 11 years old when I started to game dev. But in my opinion, it doesn't matter what is your age, what is your gender, or what is your conditions are. If you truly believe in something, there is no reason why you can't achieve it. Classical motivation speech. So I don't want to bother you anymore. Uh, to be honest, if you listen to me carefully, uh, I believe your game is going to be a hit. So anyway, let's get started. So I want to... You're having, having a problem uh, with the panel discussion. I gotta wait. Page two. Second page, please. Yes. So I want to ask you four questions. Please answer with me. So do you ever get bored in the middle of the project? Yeah. Do you ever think the project will never end? I felt that. Do you ever lose your attention to project? Or do you ever think your supervisor is sucks? Yeah, I felt all of them before in my career. So can you skip to the next page? Then that means you are screwed. Because if you fill these four questions or these four opinions, then you're kind of screwed. Because uh, you don't believe your team. You don't believe in yourself too. So uh, that means you're kind of screwed. So can you switch it? Yeah. Step one, piece by piece. It doesn't matter that you're a project manager or team lead or even freaking solo developer. You have to divide your tasks into pieces because we developers are too lazy to organize our tasks. So uh, several, years, several years ago, I had a moment that every manager had. My junior came to me and told me that he may not complete his tasks without any help. And I was like, don't play with me, bro. Come on, you can do that because uh, you already did harder part of the task, and blah, blah, blah. And, and then I told him that I'm going to change his tasks, and he went away. Ten minutes later, I have uh, I've gave to him brand new same tasks, but little I changed it a little bit uh, with easy steps, with much detail, like, bro was like, uh, Open your computer. Okay, it's already open. Checked. Then create a new C sharp script, which named Game Manager. And oh, that's one. It's hard. And blah blah blah. And then uh, actually, it worked. He completed all fi all five days before deadline. And then I was like, boom! I have new tasks for you. Of course, every manager does that. So can you skip to the next page? And step two, do not lose your attention because if you lose your attention to the project, uh, that means, like I said before, uh, you're not confident, you're not confident enough, uh, you don't believe in yourself enough, actually. Uh, especially solo developers uh, does that a lot in the developers too. Uh, can you skip to the next page? Confidence, yeah. Like I told you before, everyone makes mistakes. 
there is always be some Indian guy better than you, of course. Do not forget this is a process. Just relax. Uh, relaxing is a big part of the, uh, this process because development is development is sometimes uh, could be tough uh, or could be exhausted, exhausting or like that. Can you skip? Focus to target. The most important thing is the marketing your project to the uh, market, yeah, a store or something. Like if you're a PC developer, if you are a game developer by yourself, I mean you're a solo developer, you have to focus to your target because most of developers can't finish their project because of they're not focusing. They just develop something, they just develop some mechanic and they just share to LinkedIn, but it's not that way. It's not going to that way. Can you skip? Just finish, especially solo developers. Please listen to me carefully because most of the developers do not complete their games, like I said before. Yes, I did that too, so I know that. I have thousands of projects which is not completed. I understood that finishing a game, how important and how hard it is. It's not matter your game is worst or best, it is yours. I hated hyper casual because in hyper casual industry, you always trying to make something. You make a prototype, kill it. Make a prototype, kill it. Make a prototype and kill it. I think uh, the game developers are also artists. So uh, you do not have to kill it. You can upgrade it. You can still develop it and uh, present it to uh, your audience, your target audience. Yes, and hyper casual really helpful for junior developers to improve their skills. You always have to learn a new mechanic for developers. And actually that's it, I haven't prepared yet. That's it. Uh, thank you, Brock. Uh, do you guys have any questions for Brock? Thank you, thank you.